Here's what our entryway looks like from the inside. I put up some hooks for our white coats, and then I have this COVID table that has some hand sanitizer, disinfecting wipes, and things like that. We've got our shoes in that coat closet over there. Then to the right of the entryway is our in-unit washer dryer, which is very exciting. To the left of the entryway hallway is this built-in desk. This is usually where Chai works. He's working here now. Very hard at work. That's a salmon. <laughs> okay, very hard at work learning how to make food. Here is the guest bathroom. Again, lots of storage, including those built-in units over there. And then in here is the guest bedroom. We have some comfy seating, some random storage boxes, and a full-size bed, which will be great when my parents or anyone else comes to visit. The guest bedroom also has a walk-in closet, which is mainly being used for storage for us right now. We've got our extra suitcases and cold weather clothes and miscellaneous boxes and things like that in there. From the guest room hallway, we come out into the main living room, which is, I guess, Chai's favorite room because it has this couch, which is very comfortable, comfy enough to sleep on. All of the nice looking furniture that you see is from my mom. She used this as an excuse to get some new furniture in her place and gave some of the older furniture to us. So that included this couch and the two end tables and lamps. The grad caps on top are our additions. And then the dining table over there as well and also this coffee table, which features the TV that we got and the Nintendo Switch, very important. We haven't gotten around to hanging up our fancy diplomas yet, um, but for now we have our fancy diploma frames on either side of the TV. This is our lovely dining room area featuring some fresh flowers from Trader Joe's. If you come around from the dining room, you'll find our balcony area. We have two lovely patio chairs and a patio table. Again, all contributions from my mom. Then to the left of the dining area is my favorite part of the house, the kitchen. We have so much counter space and storage space. It's perfect for two people. The kitchen also includes a nice and spacious bar area, which is where I tend to do work. Eventually, I will get a nicer bar stool um, so I can do work there, but for now, I usually just move one of these dining chairs over there to uh, get my work done. The last main room in our apartment is the master bedroom. This room actually faces south, so it gets plenty of light but no direct sunlight. With the window open, this room is able to stay pretty cool all year round. The master bedroom also has a walk-in closet. And finally, we have the master bathroom. It's not super glamorous, but it's got a nice shower tub and glass door and it has all the counter space and storage space that we need. second day of residency orientation. Yesterday we had a bunch of intro lectures and then in the afternoon we had um, the best epic training ever, by which I mean not the best, but it was on Zoom. Today we got lots of logistical stuff set up. We uh, just took our badge photos. It's strange that I can't touch the edge of my white coat anymore. I have to like bend down to do that. That's weird. How's it going? Not bad. Kind of lunch. Did all the paperwork and starts now it's all about like the reimbursement and taxes and getting the licenses. Yeah. We gotta like pay hundreds of dollars in fees and then yeah. get that reimbursed. Gotta log our hours. 
smell our evaluation. This goes to show you being a doctor is not just like saving lives, so, so you know, no. all the logistical things too.